Hello everybody, welcome back to Born Losers Gaming and welcome back to Pokemon Legends Arceus. In this episode, Ian and I are retiring because we're rich now. I just found out, you can look at the money top right, uh, I just found out we had 10 nuggets <laughs> in our inventory that we just didn't sell. Oh, yeah. So that's 100,000 poker dollars. That's a lot of money. Also, Rufflet <sighs> can evolve. So off part, we I went again looking through, seeing what we can get. Turns out Rufflet just evolves by level up, yeah. which so long as it evolves into the uh, regional variant, uh, that would be the easiest like ride Pokemon to get in the game. Now, yeah. There he is. All right. What wow. a babe. All the others are such a pain in the, in the neck. Like, Big butt that pain. That is such a nice change of pace. I got another Razor Claw as well. Okay, that's not how Sneasel evolves. Hmm. What do you mean? What do you mean that's not how Sneasel evolved? I, I swore that's how Sneasel evolved. Is it a, a fang instead of a claw or something like that? Uh, it might be, but like, I, uh, uh, you talk to them, talk to them, talk, okay. talk for a second. Uh, sometimes we mix up our fingernails and our teeth and that's a perfectly natural part of growing up. Ex hold on. What did you say? Your mouth at all times tastes like teeth. Well, what about your gums? They also taste like teeth. Is that true? Yeah, it's like if you uh, grow onions in dirt and then you eat the dirt, it tastes faintly of onion. <laughs> faintly? Oh, yeah, I'm sure. That, I mean, yeah, I guess faintly. Yeah. That means that somebody would have had to have tested that to find out. That's fair. Uh, here's the thing, uh, babe. Okay. Yo. Uh, we grow green onions. Me and you do. Mm -hmm. Not that you know about it, but I grow green onions. They're on our balcony now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is... <laughs> this is natural. <laughs> oh, you're so short. They are so sh They're so cute, though. Finish your story, because I actually have a story I need to tell. Oh, uh, if you grow green onions in your kitchen, it smells like fucking hell. Well, it smells like hell if you don't like green onions. Green, it's such a strong, like, the water, you have to change that water so often. Mm -hmm. Because otherwise, the water turns into, like, green onion goo. Yeah, no, uh, that's that's definitely fair. I, I can see that being a bit of a problem. That's why they're outside now, because <laughs> I got <laughs> sick of it. I need to bring another Eevee because we need to go evolve. A Glaceon. Yeah, which we marked on the map over here. So we can go to that real quick. It's a um, hole. Mm -hmm. Let me also on our mini map missions. Snowpoint. Okay, so we're going to go up to Snowpoint <sighs> Temple by the end of the part. Some of um, you may remember us just diving down a hole at some point. And finding the ice. Yeah, I know. It's just like, but then it's like. Well, where is it now? I knew where it was at one point, but we haven't had it. we haven't had an Eevee at that time. So I need to tell a story about Weavile. Please tell me the story oh, about sweet. Weavile. Hole. Uh... Don't break your ankles. God, the echo is so crazy. It is really cool. Uh, I still need to get. Wait, which one was the one that I was? This is the one that I'm befriending. This is the one that's getting turned to Glacian. Um. So, everyone knows how I am with Hot Hotawuga, right? Yeah, yeah, you're good friends. Yes. Regardless of that, right? However funny or, or bad uh, people might think that is, right? Uh-huh. As in, like, oh my god, why is he in such a simp? Yes. I met someone <laughs> once. Okay, is this, like, a romantic story? No. Like, well, I, met, I met someone. It, it was romantic for them. Love at first I'm, sight. It, it is a romance story. It is not a romantic story for me. Okay. Right? Go on. Um, so, as I said, this was around three years ago. It might have even been longer than that. Four, five? Uh, oh, jeez. Pre-pandemic. Pre Pre-before the world was what it is today, right? Right. Um, I was at uh, Super Smash Con. It's a... Uh, a Smash Bros. tournament, one of the largest in the world. Um, I want to say circa 18 or 19, not positive, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And this is like in the middle of me being my most competitive. Uh, I was very into competing, trying to be the best. Uh, this is absolutely me bragging. At this point, I was like, I think ninth in the region. That's cool. Yeah, no, really Ooh, happy. Glacier. Hell yeah. 
I love Glaceon. They're, I think Glaceon might be my favorite. They're really pretty. I love Glaceon. I, I like got an idea. Oh, wow. I want to set a cane of Coke on their head. Why? Would, well, just to make it colder? Yeah. Hell yeah. All right. Great I've idea, always wanted honestly. a dog that could cool my beverage. <laughs> <laughs> Like why? Why get you know? Okay, you were humble bragging. Yes. So uh, at the Smash Hammer, I'm playing through. I get through my first wave or whatever, and I'm on to the next wave. I've been a couple of people at this point. Uh huh. Um, but it reaches the point that I come across a new challenger. Oh. And when we sit down together, they have to set up. Okay. And I'm like, okay. I mean, like you know, we all we all put our controls in and stuff, so it's like. Every, everyone has stuff they got to do beforehand, but no. Right, right. This like, give me a second to set up. I was like, yeah, okay. They pull out a plush of Weavile. Okay. And they set it up next to the monitor. I'm like, okay. Yeah, we yeah. all have a favorite Pokemon. Um, after that, they brought out a secondary plush. A smaller one. Uh-huh. Set it next to the first Weavile. Uh, was it also Weavile? It was also Weavile. Okay. And I'm like, all right. We all have a favorite Pokemon that we really like. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> After that, uh huh, they set the phone down on the table and oh. they make sure to like flatten out their super large keychain. Okay. That also has Weavile on it. It was okay. So we've got three Weaviles now. They pull out an even larger plush. Where are they keeping these? And set these? it out of this backpack. All these coming out of the backpack. Okay. They set it next to their chair, facing the monitor. Okay. And that's why I'm like, all right, we all have a Pokemon that is our favorite <laughs> we that we really, <laughs> really, really like. like. All right. They pull out a framed portrait. No. Set it up next to the TV. C can I guess what was in it? Yeah, what, what Pokemon? Do you think, was it Weavile? It was Weavile. All right. So at this point, I'm like, all right. This is, it's gone off the rails. A little bit. At this point, I'm like, all right. We all have a Pokemon we want to fuck. Okay. All right. Are you, at this moment, are you thinking about that, uh, that, like, old article about the guy who married a Twilight Sparkle plush? <laughs> like, is that flashing through your mind? Uh, I didn't even think about it. That's not something that kept my mind off. But now that I'm looking back, I'm on it. Yeah. Now that you mention it, right? Yeah. Like, I, am, I, I need to put my my partner Weavile on yeah. the ground so that they can watch me play Smash Brothers. So the best part of all of this, yeah. you and I, we're laughing. It's like, ha, ha, ha. What a, what a funny thing to happen. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, I lose and get knocked out of the tournament. Well, they had to impress Weavile. They did. And, oh, I'm sure they did. If you had, <laughs> like, uh, honestly, you know, you think they're getting any if they lose? <laughs> Oh, you're right. If they lose, no. If they are... They're sleeping <sighs> on the couch if yeah, they lose. Exactly. And the Weavile gets the bed. Oh, wait. Let me check it. I need to make sure this doesn't have any... There's a... Um, fairy moves. <laughs> That's uh fascinating to me. Yeah? I feel like I don't want to use a store card in a 7-Eleven because it's too much extra work to pull out a phone. Okay. I can't imagine going to a tournament where people have to wait on my every move. Yes. And needing to set up a shrine to a Pokemon. Yes. I, uh, Smashers are a special breed. I they, Genuinely, they're not. That is 100% old lady at a bingo tournament behavior. Oh, true. You know what? That is, they're the same breed, just a different brand of it. <laughs> 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 yeah, you're wow, you're really not wrong. That it's is like incredible. I need to set up my four troll dolls and use my three special bingo <laughs> markers, otherwise I'm not gonna win today. Yep. Uh in in honor of that person, I'll put Weavile in our special Pokemon box. <laughs> our special box. Yeah, <laughs> our, our special little box. Uh so we found out that Voltor revolves with the freaking leaf stone. Which we don't have. We do not. We for some we reason, we do have not one. have it. We have. Let's look. Let's look at our thing. Let's look at everything we have. Yeah. We have five, nine, five, three, four. Like no leaf stones. And obviously, we don't have it with us. We have a a, a shiny stone with us. Dawn. I Dawn. Think, yeah. Um. So that said, I'm looking through like what we, other Pokemon. At least we can buy a leaf stone. Well, we yeah, really but it's, need to... it's with the bags. The 
bags, man. It's hard because I almost want to just suggest you to leave Arceus open while you play like RuneScape <laughs> so yeah. that distortions form because that seems to be where you get all the stuff, you hey, know? There we go. That's the one I need. Do you yeah. know if there's like spe- specific locations of distortions where you get leaf stone versus like lightning stone? I don't, well, no, leaf stones you get just from like cracking rocks open, you know? You crack a few heads and you get a leaf stone, but me, no, not me though. Interesting. Couldn't be that lucky. Yeah. I mean, maybe you haven't cracked enough heads. If I remember right, you said Basculin has to do like enough self harm. To it's become a, a basculation. It's a high amount of damage recoil from yes. a specific attack, I think. I think double edge, because it knows double edge. So yeah. maybe wave crash even. If it's a specific move, I'll look at them. Because wave, I don't think I know wave crash. That sounds like a new move. Let's oh, check it out. Oh, shield on can evolve. You can, uh, yeah, go for it. After, All right. After, after the Weavile story, I need to get something done in game. <laughs> no, that was plenty. It was a... Uh, you know, I think it made my life better, knowing. I had to have told you this, because I was so mad afterwards. I was such a, uh, a stinky gamer. You were mad that you lost to somebody who had a shrine? <laughs> I was so distracted by their shrine. Ah, all stupid shit, right? I, admittedly, <laughs> I do feel like it's kind of psychological warfare. <laughs> I mean, honestly, a, a little bit, but like... Like, you are sitting next to a person who just set up a shrine to a Pokemon. Mm-hmm. Yep. I, I feel like I would be thrown off. <laughs> yeah, I mean, no, I, I feel like anybody would be. Yeah. But at the same time, if it's enough to throw you off from playing a freaking video game. We went to uh, a we went to a tournament not too long ago oh, because you do work things there. Yeah. And uh, I was sitting behind the little desk and watching somebody walk around with a beach chair strapped to their ass. Mm-hmm. And it, they would move... This, the chairs out of their way so they could sit in their beach chair to play Smash Brothers. Oh, I have another person. They're, they're, a, local, they're a local legend because they do that at the locals too. And I thought that was fascinating. <laughs> like, I don't want to sit in your stinky several hundred dollar game chair. I brought this thing from Walmart. Absolutely. And why not, <laughs> right? God, and why not? I don't even like sitting in beach chairs at the beach. I can't imagine voluntarily sitting one. It's so low down. It's so low. Maybe it's because I'm too tall. Maybe if somebody removed part of my legs. Mm -hmm. I've thought about that often. If I was shorter, I could sit in beach chairs better. Mm. Your mom finds them comfortable. Your mom is very short. I already had a rosary. What am I doing? doing i don't know evolving them because they're cool i know it's but it's just like it's i'm just wasting time you know I'm just going through this i know we do need to do something with stantler too so i'll just bring stantler in because why not right yeah oh i guess we need a scythe we need a, a, a caesar i have a i think i actually saw i had a metal coat oh yeah yeah right here cool we'll bring Stick that over in their little fingies because we already have uh, a steelix oh yeah yeah, we do. We caught don't have it. A, we don't. I am going to double check this one. Yeah, because, because we I, only have one. Yeah. Order. Let's order alphabetically. There we go. All right. So just find the S's all the way at the bottom. C's or C. We already, we already have, have it. Oh! That was oh almost my a God. waste. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. Ian, put that away. Someone, someone in the comments, someone shout out to you if you screaming. already knew. Yeah. If you already knew, and it's like, no, stop. Do you think there's <laughs> someone out there keeping notes on all the Pokemon we need? I think I've realized. Like a mental checklist? Not necessarily that. It's really realized that when you're watching a series, right? Yeah. Did that... It's sometimes easier to keep track on. Yeah, I, I agree with that, especially if you're, like, binge-watching. I know we have a few binge-watchers yeah. that, like, wait for the series to be done before they watch. Yep. And at that point, you just watched it, like, uh, a couple hours ago. For us, it was months mm. now, you oh. know? Yeah, exactly. And it's like, I, I totally get I, But even outside of that, too, sometimes just watching a series is so much easier to retain information than doing the series. Yeah. Which is really weird, because, like, I will have watched it twice. I will have experienced it, and I will have uh, um, edited it, right? Right, right. Uh, so it is really interesting that I will forget some things, but, like, we've only really had a few people who just really, like, know better than we do sometimes. 
Right. I, it just have it locked in. Mm. I understand. Dark, take that. it out. Thanks, bud. And I, uh, it, it's interesting because watching yeah. the let watching Let's Plays is such a wild experience. Because I'll watch like a like four hour full game series Let's Plays where somebody beats the whole game in one sitting, right? Yeah. And I'll be like, man, how can you not remember this story beat from two? The hell? Oh, okay. Hello. I thought that was like a yellow version of our foxy lady. <laughs> Uh, That's funny. But, I, yeah. You know what I mean? I'm like, yeah. how could you not remember this story beat? And then I'm yep. like, oh, shit, I would, I forget story beats, it's, too. It's all in the moment. It's like, if you remembered and they don't, then it's 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 such a, like, well, I remembered, so why didn't you? Totally forgetting all the times that you've played a game or something and forgotten some sort of story beat or right. something. Uh, so it's just like, it's different for everyone, but nobody remembers when they did poorly themselves. Yeah. And that's that, the big difference. That is very true. It, it's definitely like, you get, you get people commenting on videos that are just like, I cannot believe that you didn't do this in your first playthrough when I most certainly did not in mine. <laughs> well, I know. I, I think that's looking disparagingly at others. I think like... Some people do just experience it I on their first playthrough. I love disparaging others. Stop. No. Please. Looking down on other people makes me feel tall. It makes me feel horny. What <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> sorry. What the it fuck? It popped out. It popped out. I'm he's sorry. He's got a shaming kink and he's letting it out <laughs> in the middle of this. Letting, letting the whole room know. All right. Oh, my I'm God. I'm the whole room and I didn't need to know. I'm going to drink some orange soda. I'm going to block Born Losers Gaming on Twitter.com. <laughs> oh, Adamin. Okay, interesting. Oh, wouldn't have expected to run into you up here, Blue. What are you up to? Uh, what are you up to? Baby! You're here to try and find the secrets lurking in Snowpoint Temple, aren't you? Sure. That's what my clairvoyance told me. You do tend to get mixed up in all kinds of strange going-ons, Blue. This door here, well, they say behind it sleeps a Pokemon so great it could it could tow around the entirety of the continents that lie to the south. Figure it's a Reggie. No matter oh. what we do, the door just won't seem to open. I bet it's Regigigas is my guess. Regigigas. So it we looks gotta, like a Reggie. Yeah, with its investigate. Eyes. Just touch it. Let me oh. in. The stone plate, iron plate, and ice. Oh, yeah. so we need to get other stuff first. Ooh. That's cool. Thank God. I thought I had to solve a puzzle or some shit. I was not ready to do that. All right, get out of here, losers. I open the door. <laughs> Whatever that clairvoyance. Bleh. Hello? You Are you kidding me? Did they just leave? Are they already inside? We opened the door. Hold on. I got to absolutely demolish a Zubat real quick. That's fair. Die, asshole. I don't know if they're the asshole in this situation, to be honest. They're following me around and bugging me. Oh, I see. This is this is your, like, uh, insulting people thing. What? Stop. Coming oh back God. to roost. Do you not have moments where it's like you just, like, something comes to mind and you say it and you don't think about it af until after the fact? Like I'm sure I have. Good. You, know? you should have more of those moments on BLG so that I feel let... Oh, baby. Little bitty. So I feel less awkward. Uh, in, to be entirely fair, I'm sure I have. Okay. Uh, but you're such a weirdo that you never point him out. I'm the I'm a- I say so Whoa, that's a- that's a fat fuck. <laughs> Hello. I love him so much. Well, what time is that thing? It's colossal. It sure seems to be a Pokemon. But let's see what my clairvoyance has to say. Holy shit, it's a Pokemon! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Definitely a Pokemon! Fantastic! My clairvoyance showed me a vision of it in motion! Well, just you wait. You'll get to see it in motion in a second anyway. Can you just tell Are us? Are there really Pokemon behind me? I was about to say, leave me alone. This is my Pokesona. If I was a Pokemon, I would be this big ass creature. Big and beefy. Are you just going to say the same thing you've already said? You have yeah. To, okay, cool. That's cool. All right. I hoped your clairvoyance would be helpful. Uh, okay. How close do I have to get? I think you actually have to. Okay. I'm like, damn. It is just staying still. 
What a weirdo looking Pokemon. This Pokemon looks like if I blew on its belly, it would make flute noises. That's what I was thinking. It's like an ocarina. Yeah. Oh, just battle. I was expecting to, you know, be able to run around and stuff. It appears okay. not. This is like the uh, cricket tune from the beginning of the game. Oh, baby. It is. Okay, so normal type because ghost doesn't have any effect on it. Riggy giggy. Um, I like its name. It, it's, a, it's a hard name to say. Riggy giggy. Riggy giggy. Riggy giggy. No, I didn't mean. Oh, whatever. Whatever. It would be so funny if it just died. <laughs> like, it would be oh. really upsetting, but if you just quick attacked Regigigigi and it died immediately, what a bummer. I'm trying to find a way in my head to combine Regigigas and Regifizeme, and it's not coming out. <laughs> Build your question of the day. Can you make, could you make that happen? It's really easy. You just take the beginning of Regigigas and uh, the ending of Regifizeme, and you get Regifizeme. <laughs> Regigigizeme. Regigizeme. Regigizus. <laughs> Reggie Jesus, man. Reggie Jesus, Reg, Reggie Jesus would have given us Mother Three. That's true. <laughs> I hate how much of a meme that became. Mother Three. Well, no, just that it's like it is Reggie's fault that Mother Three wouldn't come to America when it is absolutely in no world only his call. But everybody on the planet was like, "Yep." I think it's because people had abnormal love and expectation of Reggie. Well, I would not say that. There was a time that people hated Reggie. Well, those are the why. He was Because he wouldn't bring Mother 3. But that is that his one that doesn't seem like a thing. What? That doesn't seem like a thing one person gets to decide. That's what I'm saying. Like, but I remember back uh, reading Nintendo Power like every single you Jesus. You should catch this thing. I know. I didn't think I was going to get a crit. Um reading Nintendo Power every single week and it was always number one. It was uh, something about how Mother 3 was the most requested game to come to the virtual console and to be or ported over and how Reggie was the one that was holding it back. It but really it's like, feels like it should though just come. I mean yeah. just, it just like even for the sake Black of you know slight. with Mario 3D All-Stars they basically uh, the Mario Sunshine was basically just like a, an emulator right? Well yeah, so I, well, let's finish this conversation up for the, the in-game conversation, and then we'll finish this one. Sounds good. Howdy, partners. Now that was one solid Pokemon, like a giant, like a giant born of the very earth. I guess this is just part of your job with the Silverite Corps, huh? Something like that. What kind of Pokemon is the one you just caught blue, huh? I can't wait to see it in the Pokedex when it's done. Thank you. Yeah, I'm pretty curious to read everything Mr. Professor writes up too. Do you uh? Do you think uh, Adamant has like a little a little thing for the professor? <laughs> Not something that crossed my mind. Adamant's always sure. oh Adamant's always talking about oh that funny Mr. Professor. That funny. I want to read everything man. funny little Mr. Professor writes in a cute little book. <laughs> Gather the plates related to each story Cookie to told you about. You should head back. To okay, so I'm sure yeah go back there is gonna be uh, the last story thing. Yeah. So uh, when it comes to bringing Mother Three over, I mean the problem isn't. The game, right? Yes, they could just port it, emulate it, whatever. Mm. They have to translate it. Yeah, but uh, it, I mean, <laughs> it's already been like fan translated, right? Oh yeah, but so fan translation does not necessarily mean. Well, I know, but they there's already. Also, if I remember right, there's a couple things that might be seen as problematic nowadays. Oh yeah. Um. Mother, remind me who the protagonist of Mother Three is. That Lucas. Yeah. Okay. Yes, I can understand how, based on what I know, it's a rough ride. I, I, well, no, I would say you have, there's no way to know, because it's just like stuff like in the middle ass of the story. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Do you I, think we get the other Reggies? I don't know. I mean, at this point, I would say yes, because we got Reggie Gigas, but at the same time, it's like, where are the other three? It's interesting. I wonder if we should have caught the other three somehow already. Somewhere. I, I feel like the game would have made that a lot more apparent, don't you? You would think. All but right, uh, I, I will say this. Oh, we can still level up Bergy Meat. Oh, oh, okay. Well, let's let's finish this part out by evolving Pile of Swine into Man of Swine because I feel like that should be really easy. And Bergmite. Bergmite can evolve right now. Oh, shit. Perfect. All right. Let's go over to a camp and make that happen. And we'll end the part. 
Yeah, I don't know. I would love to see Mother 3 come over, obviously, because, I mean, so many people want it that it would just, at this point, it just feels like it'd be a good idea. Yeah. Um, Morally, what do you think is the right call there? What? Do you think they should translate it faithfully with the acknowledgement that some things are problematic? Or do you uh, think they should translate it to be more appropriate for today's shit. audience? What a piece of cheese! How big is it? Because the, the, the big one was a frickin... I'm sure it's pretty small, comparatively. Oh, oh. my god! Okay. You could sunbathe on that bitch! Yeah, alright, whatever. <laughs> Um, I mean, because I, I, let me be clear in that I, it has been a while. Yeah. Um, so you don't know exactly what's problematic. Yeah. And even then it's it, whether or not it is problematic is, is arguable. Cause it could be said that it was done in like good taste. Yeah. Obviously there's some people who would probably have a problem with it. There's some people who would probably be like, no, that's totally fine. Yeah. So yeah. Just outright... I mean, that's everything though. Oh yeah, I know. But I, I just, I'm, this is a lot more in that middle ground from what I remember then. Cause there are some things that are. Not in that middle ground. But like, yes, yeah, there will some, be people who like, are okay with clearly it. Clearly, but... <laughs> that should not happen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, where the hell? I, I, I just mo meant wire. more as like a general question. Do you think things should be altered I, to be palatable for a general audience? I think. I. <laughs> I think if it is, uh, I'll, I'll give my opinion then. I think for. If the option is having the game and having things altered or not having the oh, well, game... That's, that's a way different question. That, that is a very obvious yes. Like. Right, but even still, I think like sensitivity-wise, depending on how bad the subject matter is, it just changes. Well, it's I'm not saying, that I, big of a deal. I don't, I don't think it was, which is, which is why... And because I don't know as well, I can't give a firm opinion on it. Right. Which is why, yeah, in your situation of if it's either do this or don't get the game, then yes, obviously. Right. But I'm also, I'm a lot more loose on like, if some if something bothers people, should it be changed? Yeah, why not? You yeah. know? I don't, even if it was a game from my childhood that I loved more than anything, if they were like, oh, this is upsetting people, we're going to change a, a key character, I'd be like, yeah, all right. Yeah, and I mean, it just makes sense. Yeah, that's fair. If I, it bothers people. I, th I think there's too much weight placed on, like, This has changing, to be the same. Uh, yeah, changing a game makes it worse, because it's like, it didn't change the original game. The original game's still there. Yeah. You, go, you can still play the original game. It's not as accessible, but, like... You can still play the original game in its original format yeah, yeah, yeah. somewhere, some way. For sure. Um, so it's like, wait, do, did I get to swine up in a jet ball? Does, does it, like, throw farther? Huh. <laughs> oh, that's kind of cool. I tried to find a pile of swine because I apparently don't have one. Can you not evolve the little... Oh, hey. Oh, I did a No, purple. I can't evolve the little one. Grab it. So... I think we're going to have to say next on Morelis' Gaming. Well, let's uh, evolve. Uh, did we? Oh, we already evolved. Yeah, we already did. We are, we've already done everything now. Nice. So next on Morelis' Gaming. Wait. You. I can just catch you. You're ideal. Boom. A little alpha. You're just a little alpha. A little Perfect. bitty alpha. And then, oh, you're going to evolve immediately. Okay. 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 Check us out. Check me out. We Watch lied about this. the. We lied about the next time. All right. Hold all that right. in your head. Just give me a second. Just keep keep that in your mind. Back so I don't have to say it again. We're not gonna say it again, except for the fact again. that Ian says it three times at the uh, end of every single episode. Uh oh. Where is it? What did you do? It's it's here you somewhere. You can look it up. There it's it is. Right there. There we go. We're gonna swap these out. Swinib. Perfect. From there... We could put Regigigas away, too. Oh, yes, shit! We can. we can evolve it, and then I think it needs to learn Ancient Move. Um, da, 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 da. But yeah, I just... <laughs> Mother 3 at this point should come over, and outside of the money it would take to do it... I mean, I think they know how big of a deal it is, because I'm sure them porting Earthbound and uh, Earthbound Zero Mother 1 mm -hmm. over to America now, I'm pretty yeah, sure yeah. it's made them buttloads of cash. Um, Probably so, something they're looking at then. Do you think? Yeah, I think they, they want to put it out. They're they're timing it now rather than just not doing it. I would assume, right? Like I, you would hope, yeah. I know, but you know, we've, I've also been hoping for like 15 years. So what's up, big fella? Anyway, play the Mother series if you haven't. It's a good uh, good they're good game. They're all good. All right, next I'm born. This is gaming. I didn't I didn't God. play three. I, I don't. We have so. We are so close to being done with everything. 
All right. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope you're always still enjoying the series. And I hope that I will see you all next time. Bye, everyone.